Hello friends, wizards, witches and muggles. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well. Today we are here at the Lonely Broomstick in Scotland, which is a very magical and whimsical shop. So if you want to come shop with me and have a little tour, then come on in. Welcome to the Lonely Broomstick. We are here in a very nice and quiet store. We've got it closed just to film for you guys and I cannot wait to show you because this place is something else. And I'm going to start over here, which is like the first section that we come to. We've got we've got some Mina Lima cards over here, which are so beautiful. I really like this chocolate frog one, actually. Um, I have quite a few of these myself. There's some that I've actually not seen. That Bertie Bot one's quite nice as well. So if you need some magical greeting cards, you know where to come. So when you come into the shop, one of the first things that you see is like this massive bookcase uh, full of books, but not only books. We've also got quite a lot of potions. And it is one of those shops where there's so many different things that you are gonna wanna spend quite a bit of time making sure that you don't miss things because there's so much to see. So we've got potions, we've got some crochet things. Um, <laughs> we've got these tiny little dobbies with little hearts on. They're very cute. There's a whole basket of baby dobbies. There's also got quite a lot of Harry Potter books. We've got all of the illustrated editions. We've got the art of Harry Potter. They're, every Harry Potter book that you could think of adding to your collection, there's a lot here, including the Mina Lima illustrated editions, which are fairly new. Now, if we move over to here, we've actually got some more kind of general magic and whimsical books, which I'm definitely going to have a little flick through later. There's um, some that are really catching my eye, especially these kind of crystal ones. There's, um, what is this? There's some Terry Pratchett books, which are pretty cool. There's some general magic ones, curiosities. There's lots of cool things, soul magic. Very nice. There's even things that are just hung in between the shelves. As I said, you could probably miss things. Now, let's move over to here. We've got some, we got some wax melts. What have we got? Ooh, lip balms. I do like a lip balm. Oh, I love these pennants. Big fan of those. So this store definitely caters towards a lot of small businesses as well as licensed things too. Whoa, <laughs> there's so much sweet things here. We've got candles, we've got some handmade things, but this is intriguing me the most. We've got the Lonely Broomsticks original chocolate frog hot chocolate. That's really pretty. Gold foiling, we've even got some ice mice. We've got all sorts of things here. We've got butter beer. What are these? Oh, cauldron cola. That's exciting. Um, we've got the Lonely Broomstick Butterscotch Beer. I mean, that does look nice. So many different beverages. Butterscotch Beer, Spellbound. I mean, I'm gonna have to get some. Wizard's Brew. I mean, these are very exciting. <laughs> get a bit thirsty. We've also got, you know, a bit of the Mad Hatter over here. And if you actually look up to the ceiling, there's clouds. We've got a lot of letters, lots of balloons. It's like the sky is above us, which is quite cool. And <laughs> I mean, if you haven't seen it already, here is um, Hagrid's motorbike. Can I get on it? Ooh, she's got her leg over. <laughs> okay, now I'm not gonna drive this in the shop wouldn't be very safe. <laughs> but either way, this is a really cool photo opportunity here if you do wanna get on, maybe get in the little sidecar with a friend. There's a crochet Harry in there at the moment. But let's carry on around the shop. Now, one thing that caught my eye as soon as I came in here was a trunk, which is the Lonely Broomsticks, books of mystery. And these just excite me a lot. So. Each book has kind of what they're about and the rating as well. I've picked one that's five out of five, so this is apparently really good. It's a novel and it's, does it say domestic fiction? Um, that's really cool. There's a thriller, mystery and spy book there, but there's loads. So if you don't know what to read and you want to add something to your bookshelf and you can't choose, Pick yourself a mystery book. Love that idea. I think that's so, so cool. Oh my God, look at these little mallards. <laughs> They're so cute. Oh, cute, little handmade. <gasps> these would be so cute on my Harry Potter Christmas tree. Oh, so fluffy. <laughs> this is cool. They've got Mina Lima 
uh, wrapping paper. We've got some scrunchies. I've actually never seen official hair scrunchies. So we've got um, Honey Dukes ones, Hogwarts and Death Eater scrunchies. They're pretty cool. I like that. Oh, Time Turner hair slides. I have never seen those. Very shiny. Cute. Now it smells very good in this section of the shop because the Lonely Broomstick make their own candles as well. So they have all of these magical inspired candles. There's one here called the Burrows Candle and there is a rubber duck on top. I'm gonna give it a smell. <sighs> that smells like fresh apple pie. That smells so good, I want to eat it. We don't eat candles though. I'm gonna smell the Luna one as well. That smells so nice. It's like fruity but floral at the same time. Oh, we got some decorations as well, like little handmade quilt. I mean, I might have to pick some of those up for the Christmas tree. <laughs> so we've got loads of crochet things. We've got some bags. We've got, what are you? This is very nice. Are you a candle? Oh, you are. Enchanted forest. Oh my, I might have to get that, you know. Oh, they're all different. There's Cozy Bakery, Cottage by the Sea, Fairy Springs. Oh, these are nice, these are nice. Can we just talk about the labels on these? These are so lovely. Very nice indeed. So this is like a bit of spells, like witches, like we've got Salem spells. We've got the witch kitchen, these cute little witchy mini signs. I like those. Right, there's so many things to see. Let's not miss this section because we can see some little furry beasts. We've got some little official pygmy puffs. We've got some handmade puffs. Oh, this one's very, this one's very soft. Whales of fluffy. Um, <laughs> and we've got some little beasts. <laughs> this one's very fluffy. <laughs> I like him. Oh, I really like him. They're very nice. We've got some trunks. Um, guys, I actually own one of these. Do these have things in? It sounds like there's things in these. But either way, these are the little Hogwarts trunk handbags, which I adore. I have one in my collection, do like that. Loads of decorations up here. Now we do have quite a lot of things from Noble Collection in this store as well. We've got, we got the Time Turner. I know guys, I'm not wearing it today, <laughs> but we've got loads of little bits and bobs. Everything's kind of, there's so much to see. We've got the Ravenclaw Lost Diadem. We've got a load of sweets. And I quite like how these are themed. So we've got Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff and loads of cool things. Like I don't want to miss things. Lots of jewelry in here, which this is cool. They've got some official, Harry Potter jewelry. I have never seen that before. I might have to uh, have a little closer look at that later. Oh, that's nice. I do like that. This is a the Grimm teacup, which has been designed and they're all different as well. They're like these vintage teacups, which are quite nice. Do like a teacup. You guys know I have a little bit of a collection going on. So we've kind of skipped the middle bit. So there's patches. There's wands, we've got wizard's chess. Okay, what else we got? We've got some original artwork down here, which is by an artist called Kevin Cantwell. We've got Alan Rickman, God bless his soul. Uh, and guys, if you thought that they were gonna let you down on pins, you were wrong. Welcome to the pin section in the Lonely Broomstick. Let's have a little look at what pins they've got. They've definitely got some that I've never seen before. This one is All Flavour Beans by The Mad Unicorn. That's quite nice. They also do an Ice Mice one as well. Ooh, oh, interactive pin. They've got some really nice pins. Really, really nice pins. Oh, they've got some, a lot of pins I've not seen. These are nice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna purchase myself pins. I'm just gonna shuffle on back around to where we were because you guys know that I love a good bath bomb. The Lonely Broomstick do have a bath bomb self-care section. They've even got, I've noticed that they do, uh, and apparently these are quite popular. This is the Lonely Broomstick's advanced potion making bath set. It contains a magical cauldron, four potion bath ingredients, and then three mini bath bombs. That is very cute. I like that idea a lot. They've also got a lot of individual bath bombs. All sorts of bits, which is cute. Moon dust, that sounds exciting. But yeah, so if you like a good 
soak and you want some magic in your bath, they do things there too. There's a lot of mandrakes here, I've got to say. All sorts of sizes. <laughs> I don't have my earmuffs, so I don't want to disturb them actually. But yes, there's lots of those. What else have we got around here? Oh, these are cute, these are cute. Who makes these? These are very cute. These are by, it's Cheeky Trendy, is that the name of them? Either way, look at how cute these little hanging umbrellas are. I like those a lot. So jazzy. So all sorts of different handmade earrings. I like those a lot. We've got even more pins over here and even more earrings. Let's, oh, oh, cute. These are like little keys to go on your keychain that look vintage, they're nice. We've got some of the witch's cabin. Now, the witch's cabin, Gonzalo is one of my friends. Uh, this is one of my favorite pins that he does. It's the golden pointing hand. Um, I definitely have one of these in my collection already, but there's a few um, of these here. And this is one shop that I know that does stock Gonzalo's stuff, including some of his handmade wearables, which I'll show you soon, because I'm very excited to show you those. And suddenly I've turned around from even more pins and I met with a very magical sweet shop. Um, this is exciting. I've got such a sweet tooth. Uh, we've got more of the butterscotch beer here. We've got some, oh, hogshead glasses. And I mean, polyjuice potion. These are nice. I like, oh, these are lovely. These are handmade and beautiful. These are made in Italy. Look at that nice kind of golden glaze. Oh, that excites me a lot. That excites me. I like those. Okay, so <laughs> we've got some of the licensed stuff up here. So you can get your very own chocolate frog from here with some wizard's card. We've got Bertie Bell beans, peppermint toads, all of the things that you can think of. And then well, Lonely Broomsticks even made some ice mice, which is quite cool. Exploding bonbons, which I've heard are extremely, extremely sour, which I'm not sure I'm gonna try one today. But there's even got little sherbet lemons, the Lonely Broomsticks sherbet lemons. I really like these. Oh, these are cute as well. They do their own little beans of every flavor. They look really juicy, really big. <laughs> And then we've got some chocolate. We've even got these wizard chocolate bars as well. We've seen those before. Um, and then we've got so many sweets, pick a mix. I mean, that's a good price for pick a mix actually, 349. My favorite sweets, if I was to pick some off this wall, it would probably be chocolate limes. Love those. We've got fizzy peaches. What else would I choose? Rhubarb and custards, they are top tier. Yeah, they've got some good candy going on over here. And oh, they've got pre-made ones over here. Oh, we've got mugs. We do, we've got some magical mugs. I think there's some more around the other side as well. These are very cute. I love the, oh, I don't need more mugs in my collection, but these are so cute. I really want this one. This is by, uh, oh no, it's called the Butterfly and the Toad Store. I don't know if that's the art or the artiste. But either way, this one might have to come home with me. It's really, really pretty. Oh my God, gob stopping gob stopper. I have not had a gob stopper since I was a child. <laughs> I haven't had one of these. This packaging is really nice. It says the most popular remedy for chittering chatterboxes or loathsome loudmouths, guaranteeing you some well-deserved tranquility and relaxation. So these are made by the Lonely Broomstick as well, which is quite cool. And I've just noticed they've got a collection box of all their sweets that you can buy if you want to have a little taste test of everything. Now, this corner, it might be a little bit dark, but this is where they've got some handmade clothes. So these are made by Mr. Malkins on Instagram. They're all hand knitted. They're so lovely. I might have to add this to my wardrobe. I may have to, because look at it. So cute. They're really nice. And there's even these adorable berets. Like how cute are these? Little toadstool beret. We've got a little pumpkin beret. <laughs> oh, they're so lovely. They're so lovely. It's really nice to see some of Gonzalo's stuff in person, because apart from the stuff I've bought, I haven't seen a lot of it. Now, there's something I've been hiding from you guys. We have come to a very special section of the Lonely Broomstick. You can book very magical potion making 
experiences here. This is the School of Witchcraft and Potions. So you can book online at thelonelybroomstick.co.uk. I will leave their information down below. But they have their very own potion making classroom and you can book in groups and come here. Like how, this is like stepping into Snake's, Snape's classroom. Like look at all of these ingredients and they've got like little cauldrons. Oh, oh they're actually made out of metal as well. I need to have a potion day here, bring some of my friends. This is so cute. Like there's just so much to see. Like the set design here is so cool. I love that they've even got moving, moving portraits. Oh look, everyone gets a wand as well when you come to make um, potions. Swish, flick and all that. God, think of all the potions I could make in here. There's even got little Nagini's venom. Ooh, don't want to know how you captured that. But yeah, so you can get your very own little experiences here. I mean, not little, it's a whole room dedicated to potion making. How cool is that? I'm, <laughs> I could live in here. It's very nice. It feels very magical. <laughs> now this isn't the only magical experience here at the Lonely Broomstick. They also do magical beverages. That's right, they make their own magical drinks and I'm gonna taste test a couple of them today. So we've got a cold one and a hot one to try. So this one here is a golden snitch so this is a delicious caramel hot chocolate with all the golden sprinkles even a little straw with wings which is so cute and there's even got a frozen butter beer and you can also get hot ones as well which is exciting so i'm going to try the cold one first which it's got popcorn on it how cute is this so go to give that a little it's very cold which you would kind of expect from a frozen butter beer so very sweet if you like sweet treats and then there is the hot golden snitch how adorable is this oh that is very nice i am giving that a 10 out of 10 10 golden snitches out of 10. now they don't just do these two drinks they actually do a lot more they do a chocolate frog hot chocolate they do living death felix felicis wolf spain like all sorts of things they've got like frozen strawberry flavored potion slushies like there's a lot to choose from so hey let me know what your favorite drink is if you manage to visit the lonely broomstick here because there's a lot of fun things to do and i think i'm gonna go and do a little bit of shopping so watch out for a lonely broomstick haul here on this channel now we're going to be doing something really special to finish off this video because the lonely broomstick want to give away a hundred pound voucher to come and spend at this store so if you are interested in getting your hands on that very magical voucher then all the information will be down below in the description and be sure to follow the lonely broomstick on instagram again linked down below so i hope you have enjoyed this very magical shop tour leave a comment down below of what was your favorite part and if you're gonna plan a visit here in the future and i guess i will see you soon i just said future really weirdly <laughs> See you guys soon. Bye. <laughs> I haven't had a sour sweet for years. <laughs> okay. They're quite sour. Mm. <laughs>